How is that possible? How is it possible I could crank one out there whatever, to whatever it was with a beautiful, sweet little draw off the knees? And I promise you, it was the second take. How is that possible? Well, everything that we hear about with golfers coming to GMS is about hips, hips, hips. It's like hip, hip, hooray. Everybody's trying to get drive every the hips out of the way. And we've done a bunch of videos talking about how should the hips move. So absolutely go to our YouTube page and, and check it out. But how is it possible that I was able to hit it that well off my knees? Now, give absolute credit to Wally Armstrong. Saw him do it in his DVDs back in the late 80s, early 90s, and it amazed me, and it still amazes me today. And the point is, back then, everybody was talking about in the 80s, leg drive, leg drive like Nicholas. Well, as he doing that, what was starting to happen, everybody was leg driving, and they were dropping back like this, and they'd come in with open club face, unless you're a tour pro who has the coordination to square up the club face. But most people struggled. And then in the 2000s, it became hip, hip, hooray. And everybody is trying to get this, but now even with this flexibility, where most people won't, where's the club? Now, if you even have less flexibility and you can't separate your hips from your shoulders and you try to do this, you're gonna come across and over the top. What did I just do? I was here and I was able to what? Hit the ball out there. How much did my hips move? Well, if I was doing it in this way, how much do my hips move? That's about it. So is the power coming from trying to use those hips? No, I didn't try to hit there, but by trying to use my hips more than other parts of my body, what does it do? You try to do it, and what's it doing to my center of gravity? It's keeping it back. So now my club's gonna put bottom out here. Now with the driver, it may not do the same, but you're here and you're trying to get the hips, 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 hips. I'm trying, I'm trying, where's that club face? Right or left. Get into understanding what your center of gravity does. Some people can call it the core, we call it the center of gravity. It's amazing how now every athletic sport, the center of gravity is moving towards the target you're trying to hit. The same as in golf. But if your hips are trying to go first, where's the center going? Back. That's not good for, for excuse me, propulsion to your target. Sorry, I gotta practice that word next time. This is Mark Solomon with Golf Made Simple at the beautiful Indian Wells Golf Resort, a true managed facility saying thank you for listening. Try some off your knees. We'll talk to you next week.